G'day viewers, it's Graham here, first Omega Man channel. Now, like the title says, don't buy silver coins. Why? Okay, I'm about to explain that to you. If you're going to buy silver, you're going to buy it in silver bars. That's the best and the only way I ever recommend you buy it. If you're a collector and you like pretty pictures, no worries. But the thing is, most of you out there are all about either saving your wealth, uh, protecting yourself from events that are coming or even to make a little money but they're not the points the point is you want as much silver as you can get in your pocket for the least amount of money spent and that's what's important so if you want pretty pictures you're going to pay for them as far as I'm concerned when it comes to silver I'm not interested in art now here's the fact if you go to the Perth Mint website which I'll put a link to underneath here there's a price list and I'll explain to you the differences. Now, if you're going to go and buy 10 ounces of silver coins today, it'll cost you $397. But if you buy a 10 ounce bar, it'll cost you $318. So by my calculations, that's around about 79, 80 bucks savings. Which is good, because it's just under a third of the price of another 10 ounce bar. So if you go and buy 30 one ounce coins, it'll cost you $1,191 Australian. But if you go and buy three 10 ounce bars, it'll cost you uh, sorry, $954 Australian. Alright, so that's a bit of a saving right there. Now, if you go and buy... Um, Let's see, uh, if you go and buy 31 ounce coins, it'll cost you that, 1191 But if you go and buy four 10 ounce bars, it'll cost you $1,272. So it's $81 more expensive to buy 40 ounces in bars than it is 30 ounces in coins. Now, I'm a lot happier to kick in 81 bucks to get me 40 ounces sooner than have 30 ounces. Now you can see that's quite clear, right? Now, a lot of these guys out there haven't got the money to buy 10 ounce bars. But I would suggest that you save your fiat currency or your cash or whatever it is you're doing to buy 10 ounce bars. A lot of places sell bars that are smaller than 10 ounces. They'll sell 1 ounce bars. But the smallest one that's at the Perth Mint is a 10 ounce. Now if you can get smaller bars, well obviously you don't need to save as much money to go and buy your bars. However, you'll still find where whatever mint you go to, it's cheaper to buy bars because there's no minting costs on the bars and that's what it's coming down to, is you're paying for a coin to be struck. Whereas a bar is poured and is a lot, lab a lot less labour intensive, so it's just good common sense. You want to buy bars and stay away from coins. Coins are not a good, uh, they are, a silver coin is a good investment, but nowhere near as good as a silver bar, okay? If you can't get silver bars, obviously you have to get silver coins. But these, these days, you want to get as much as you can, because that's what we're in it for. So I suggest that you only purchase silver bars, no matter what their size, sooner than buy silver coins. Now those, those numbers are fairly easy to see on the website. You can do your own calculations, the site's updated every day, so it's a current price list. The reason the Perth Mint uh, has this website, ironically enough, is because, as a lot of you know, I was the first person to put silver bars on YouTube. Uh, you can ask around if you don't believe that or you don't haven't heard it before, but that is the fact. I put um, this very information that I'm giving you right now, the, the first video, and I showed you bars and I showed you coins. And the fact is that um, that little message seems to have got lost along the way. Right, now if you're going to um, buy your silver coins because you want pretty pictures, that's fine. But I have to emphasize again and again and again this is about saving wealth or creating wealth it's got nothing to do with the um, new numismatic values or 
collectors um, uh, hobbies and things like that there are a lot of people doing that if uh, you want to do that that's fine you're still going to have something of worth however most of you don't have a great deal of money so it's more important for you to get more silver rather than pretty pictures so I'll emphasize it again you will save $80 by buying a 10 ounce bar so rather than buying 10 ounce 10 ounces of coins of one ounce coins that's pretty straightforward it's pretty simple now if you can get bars buy bars stay away from the coins right I think that's about all I had to tell you um, but uh, you need to look at that it's a fact you can check it for yourself the websites there so for the use out there who are collecting silver the whole reason it's happening is because I started to tell you so for those who don't know me my name's Graham subscribe to my channel which is the first Omega Man and I'll keep you up to date on facts that I know about silver and the game I suggest that you listen to this simply because you are now purchasing silver because I suggested that you did it and how to do it so if you're doing that you've already listened to me before so it's worth listening again subscribe to my channel and I'll give you all the facts I can find but I'll also give you lots of facts about other things and for those of you who know me you know this to be true and that uh, I've got a lot of other information to help you out with a lot of different things the Omega program is getting closer and you'll be able to find out what you need to do with your silver so I suggest that you come to YouTube if that's uh, if you're listening to this somewhere else and I'll give you as much information as many things as I can so I say thank you for listening and thank you to all those people who have listened to me before and just remember the Perth Mint's got that website up because I used to pester them 10 times a day for prices and so they put that site up and now I don't have to pester them <coughs> excuse me and you just get the information nice and easy so some of the hard work that I did in the past is paying off now for you guys so I can only emphasize again listen to what I'm saying I'm only going to tell you the truth I'm only going to give you facts and this is not about me trying to get you to do things that are not good for you so to those new listeners and to the old listeners and to the viewers on YouTube thank you be good to yourself get a little silver in your pocket be good to your mum. Cheers.